Okay, today we're showcasing the 19mm steel strapping kit. Uh, when it comes with these hand tools, this is the tensioner, so you can tension your strap. These are the crimpers, so you can apply a seal to seal the strap. And these are the seals that you will apply. You get a thousand of them in the box. Strap feed is something you can purchase separately. We're going to use this to get the strap under the pallet. We've also got some angle boards here to brace the corners of our pallet. We've also got the steel strap cutter, which will make cutting the strap a little bit easier for you. So we're going to put the angle boards on first. going to start from the top and dispense our steel strap make a loop around the pallet. Have our strap feeder. I'm going to put the steel strap in the strap feeder and use this to push under the pallet as I dispense more strap from the top. Hello, Dan. Wheel. Now my strap's all the way through. I'm going to come to the other side. Yeah. Get the strap feeder out of the way. Pick up my strapping loop. I'm going to guide that to the top of the pallet. Now that I've made my loop, I'm going to get my tensioner. I'm going to clamp it onto the strap and use the back guide to make sure it's all in line. And then we're going to tension. And you can see that's getting nice and tight. Once it's nice and tight, we're going to put a seal on it to keep the strap together. Here's one of these seals just at the mouth of our tensioner here. And get the handle out of the way by just using this lever here and then we're going to crimp on so now that we've completed our loop we can use our steel strap cutter to cut off the excess Now we're going to repeat the same process, just make sure we're securely attached to the pallet. Again, over the top. We're coming down into the strap feeder. Sliding that strap under as you dispense with the top hands. Then we're going to retrieve our strap. Bring the loop to the top of the pallet. Tension is going on. Lining up with the back guard, and then we're tensioning. That's nice and tight. Again, I'm going to get a handle out of the way. I'm going to put our clip on, and we're going to crimp. And then we simply bend the strap against the buckle. And that's done.